Got a question for you. Do you like candy bars or cookies or granola bars? Ha, this girl does. So I thought today I would make my husband a little snack for later because we ran out of uh, Girl Scout cookies. So um, I thought, well, let's make the next best thing. I'm gonna make a Thin Mint cookie for him today or a version of, if you will. So I pulled out my Pampered Chef snack bar maker and I'm getting ready to uh, make some of those cookies for later. So hey, let's shoot a video on it. All right, so we have here my Pampered Chef snack bar maker. It is a 10 by 15 silicone pan and it comes with a lid. This lid uh, is freezer safe. Put that over here right to the side, get that out of our way. And this 10 by 15 silicone pan is fantastic. It's freezer safe, dishwasher safe, and oven safe. I know, oven safe to 450 degrees. Because you can make numerous things. All those things that I had mentioned, candy bars and granola bars and cookies, you can make that in here. I like it because there's 12 wells. So if your family has different tastes or allergies, you can make all different kinds. Get your kiddos involved and have them help make their own granola bar or candy bar. So today I'm gonna do, like I said, the Thin Mint Cookie. Just a couple ingredients, ingredients that I actually had here at home already. So that is why I chose that. Starting with graham crackers, a chocolate graham cracker. We're gonna go ahead and kind of measure it, if you will, against a well. Guess I better get my body out of here so you can see that. So I kind of have it here so I know about how much. Now this doesn't have to be exact, it's for you guys, right? You don't have to be a gourmet chef. So I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna take off, sliver off a little bit of the sides. I'm just using the Forge Cutlery Knives. Oh, I love Forge Cutlery Knives. Lifetime warranty, oh, it's just fantastic. It was a great, great buy from Pampered Chef. So put my cookie in here. Whoops, it's a little long. Gonna go ahead and kind of make an incision, if you will. And we're just gonna make this little guy somehow fit. Yeah, get right down in there. And you can see I've already got a couple more cut. Let's do another one. Now I am using one of my Pampered Chef cutting boards. It's a polypropylene. This one has um, metric and standard um, numbers on the side. So it's nice and easy for measuring. We've got two different styles. But for stuff like this, I like to, and yet I actually use that. But for stuff like this for cutting, I like to use our high density polypropylene uh, cutting boards. Okay, so I have cut my different, a um, little cumbersome here. I have cut the different things out into the wells. And just before I went on video, I had melted some Andy's mints in our silicone prep bowls. Now you've probably heard of the glass prep bowls, but these are silicone and I love these for baking because they squeeze. So when you melt chocolate, it's much easier to pour. It comes in a one cup, two cup, three cup. We're gonna, I have in here some coconut oil. And like I said, just a whole bunch of little Andy mints. Now I have some making mint chip ice cream. I had some leftover um, chunks like this. So I kind of threw that in there. We're gonna make sure this is all whisked up. Oh, it smells good. I wouldn't mind just getting a spoon right now, right? Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and just pour over the cookies, just like so. And you can put as little or as much as you want on these. I'm just kinda doing this real quick for a video. Probably should make it look a lot cuter, but I'm not. <laughs> um, we can go ahead and take our scrapers and kind of spread out the chocolate a little bit on this. We need to remove this guy here. There we go, let's get that right out of the way. Push this little fella right down. Scrapers are really nice. They, um, we use them a lot for cooking, kind of more so than we do spoons, to be honest. The head of it's about 650 degrees heat resistant, the handle, not as much, it's about 450. There we go. Okay, they're maybe not as gorgeous, but you know what, it's just for us. So then what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put the lid back on this. I'm gonna throw it in the freezer for 10 minutes. In 10 minutes, my cookies are done. And with the magic of television, bada boom, bada bing, I've already got some done. So I'm gonna go ahead, and if you get the snack bar maker set, it comes with this nice little matching nylon spatula. 
and your cookies will come out just like so. And so now you have a nice thin mint cookie. Any questions or if you would like to see this or get more information on this, just let me know. Thanks.